how to make stuffed diesel goat or kakora or kakrol. So for that we will need 250 gram of kakora or diesel goat, 2 cups of water, 2 tablespoon of poppy seed paste, 2 tablespoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder, 1 teaspoon of chilli powder that is red chilli powder. Here I have 1 cup of grated coconut, they are finely grated, 2 tablespoon of paste of mustard seed. And here is the onion garlic paste. So for this I have used 2 large onion and 7 to 8 cloves of garlic. So here is 2 green chilli roughly chopped, 1 teaspoon of coriander powder, 1 teaspoon of cumin seed, 1 teaspoon of turmeric, salt to taste, bay leaves, chopped raisin, they are roughly chopped. So here I have a tomato puree. For the tomato puree I have used 1 large tomato and oil as required. First of all, I'll make some hollow by using a knife or you can use a spoon as well. So, thing is you have to scoop out all the seeds from the kakoda or teasel gourd. So, as you can see, I have made a hollow inside the kakoda or teasel gourd. So, likewise, I'll do the rest of the kakoda. So, they are now all done. Now, I'll make the stuffing. So, this is the poppy seed paste. Into it, I'm adding the mustard seed paste. And next is the coconut. And next is the raisins. So next, just mix them well. I am adding pinch of salt. Next mix again. So they are now well mixed. So now, just pour the stuffing into your kakoda or teasel goat. The stuffing is done. Next, I'll do the rest of the kakoda or teasel goat. Then now done. We'll need a small dough. I have made it out of wheat flour. So just take small portion from the dough. And next, just block the hole with your dough. So make sure that all your teasel goats are well sealed. Now done. I have sealed them properly. Next, I have heated my oil. I'm gonna deep fry them. Simmer your clam and just fry them so you can cover them. And next, I'll flip the kakrol or kakura and we'll fry the other side. 10 minutes so they are now done. So I'm gonna place them in the platter and next I'll twist the gravy. I'll heat it 2 tablespoons of oil into it. I'm adding bay leaves. Roughly chopped green chilies and the cumin seeds. So next I'll wait until this clutter is cluttering. So now at this moment I'll dine it. Now saute wheel for the additional one minute on low flame. So as you can see the oil is separating from them. So at this moment add the tomato puree. Mix very well. All the spices here, that is cumin powder, cinder powder, salt to taste, and the turmeric. Next is the chili powder, that is Kashmiri red chili powder and dried red chili powder. Mix well and cook them until the oil again separates from them. So now the oil is again separating from the masala. At that moment, add the teasel gourd the kakora or kakrol and next just well coat them with the masalas for the additional one minute I'll cook them so now I'm adding two cups of water into it cook them for additional five to ten minutes previous thickened it's done now so now I'm gonna serve them so here is our stuffed teasel goat or kakura or kakrol this is one of my favorite dishes so that's all for today foodies bye bye